Hey guys, and welcome to another tutorial. Today, I'm going to show you how to make a mod for Grand Theft Auto 5. This is very easy today. I'm going to be showing you how to make your own texture and put that into the game. Okay, so the first thing you're going to need is uh, OpenIV, this program right here. Uh, it's a free download. I'll put the link in the description. Uh, you need this to just view all the game files and stuff and um, that's how we mod the game. Also you'll need a GIMP or Photoshop or something that uh, can edit photos pretty much, a photo editor. GIMP is a free option if you can't afford Photoshop so that'll be in the description as well. So the first step is to find what texture we want to edit or mod. So we're gonna go ahead and open IV, open 4 actually and you're going to scroll down to Grand Theft Auto 5 and you're going to click Windows. Okay, so now once we've opened, we want to go to Tools and ASI Manager. Now these will be yellow, or ASI Loader will be yellow or red for you. Make sure it's installed. It's not necessary, but it's just good to uh, do it once you first open it. So make sure both of these are installed. Okay, so this just acts like your game directory. This is all the game files really just compressed. So. I'm going to go down to uh, x64e, this folder here, and then we're going to double click on levels, GTA 5, and then down to vehicles.rpf. Okay, so now I've opened the um, vehicles RPF. This is all the vehicles, well, these are all the vehicles for the game. Now I've decided to uh, edit the bus texture just to show you an example. So I'm going to go down and find the bus. Here it is. Okay, so dot y f t is like uh, the model, like this. So there it is. As you can see, it's not um, textured there. It's just you know the basics there. And the y t d is the texture. So these are all the textures we can edit for the bus. Now bus underscore high dot y f t is just a um, higher resolution version okay so we're going to find the high resolution texture as well if I can find it now some some of them don't have it and I don't think the bus does have it so that's alright we're going to double click on bus.ytd okay and then these as I said these are what the textures you can edit I want to edit um, just some of the decals so the Los Santos, the transit, take the bullet, uh, and this. I'm going to turn it into a YouTube bus. I'm going to replace it with YouTube logo. So what we have to do is click on the first one at the top and go export all textures. And we're going to go portable network graphics. This is just a PNG. So I'm going to go and extract that or select a folder you want to uh, extract all these textures to. I've made a folder before. Okay, and that's done. So we're going to exit out of that and minimize open IV and open the folder we exported all the textures to. So here they are. So I was going to edit this one and this one. So let's uh, grab those and drag them into your editing program and let's get editing. Okay, so now I've finished my edit, I'm going to go ahead and save this. Now I'm not going to overwrite the original because we always want a backup of our file. So I'm going to make a new folder and call this modded. So I know which are the modded files. So I'm going to go ahead and export. And there we are. So we've got open for open again. And we're going to hit edit mode. Okay. While in editing mode, all changes will be automatically saved. Do you wish to continue? Yes. Okay. So we want to replace the original texture with our modded one. So double click bus.ytd or whatever vehicle you are editing. We're going to go down to the uh, metro train glass. There it is. As you can see, it's still got the original file. So make sure you're in edit, edit mode and go ahead and hit replace. Okay, and all we need to do is grab our modded file, go ahead and open. And there it is. And that's pretty much it, guys. Go ahead and hit save. So let's open our bus.yft. 
and as you can see there is our play button now obviously it doesn't look amazing I spent about half a millisecond making this but obviously you're gonna make yours look very nice and sexy okay guys so we know we've successfully uh, replaced the file but let's say someone wants to install it, a friend or someone on the internet, that's very easy. Now what we have to do is right click the file we edited, okay, bus.ytd, hit extract or control E. And we're going to extract that to our modded folder. Alright, now it's been extracted, let's go have a look. And there it is, bus.ytd. Now all people have to do to install your mod that you made is make sure they're in edit mode and all they have to do is drag bus.ytd over the original file and it will replace it. It's easy as that. So, I'm gonna hit edit mode again, close out of OpenIV and check it in the game. Okay guys, we're in game and it worked. There is our beautiful texture. Our YouTube bus, hooray. So, Thanks guys for watching, um, please remember to subscribe if you want more tutorials or playthroughs, I'll be making a lot, a lot of GTA content in the next however long I live, I guess. So there it is, very easy, very simple, have a good one.